Hello everyone and welcome to Kage Kakorio. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna make this a, a like one-off video or include this in a vlog. Let me know what you guys think of me including these in a vlog. Um, so the vlog can be longer. There's the glitter on my face all over now. Or um, I should have these be standalone videos. So this will just be like the video for this self right here. So, so I'm not going to do like I wouldn't include it in a vlog. This will be just like. A tutorial and stuff so let me know what you think about that um this is the look it is a full look i love it so much the brushes i used are my pomi brushes they are now on pre-sale on the website the brushes by themselves the nehemiah collection that is 75 dollars the nehemiah collection with the pomi brush selena that is 85 dollars for both and the brush selena that i think is for 15 dollars on the web i mean 15 dollars Jesus, ten dollars. I don't remember on the website. So this is the look, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Um, thank you for your support. Oh, and don't forget that I you have to if it's the first time viewing my channel and you like it, please unsubscribe, refresh, and then resubscribe so everything is nice and fresh. I'm working on building back this page. So let's do it together. I'm working on doing um um con constant content. So putting out a video every other day, that's working really, really good for me. So we're just going to continue doing that until the cows come home. Or until I call back my cow them. Because it was in my room, but I'm room. I pressure the cow. Oh, God, you guys. Nice fever. <sighs> You guys know I get night fever whenever, whenever I'm highly stressed. I cannot believe my ball, you know? Garlic. So I rub the garlic on it. And then I use the garlic to push it down. Blood cleanse. It burns. I'm not going to say something where... People might not agree with, but that video I did that I uploaded with the beauty and the put this the beauty and the Bible. Yeah, whenever I make videos like those, and I'm telling the side, something always happened to me, you know, like without fail, like that's the shit that happens in my life. But me, they kind of expect something still, and then I had an ongoing issue that was just consuming my life, so. Um, this portion of the vlog, this got my hair. I'm so proud of my hair. Look it, I have thin edges. I need a product to thicken my edges. Like how oh, my hair is this thick. I want see, look how look see, come out yes, sir. Watch it. I want it to be thick all the way, like how oh, this thick. That's what I want. You can see that my hairline, my hairline. Oh yeah, I can see that my hairline uneven. You see, I'm a far big like you know. Them say girl with big far no for swing low. Sweat chariot. When I do the sponge, I sponge it. Look on my fleshy fleshy. When I do the sponge, I do this, and then when I get to the top, I kind of um make the, so I don't go as deep like this. It fast, 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 and then on the top, I just take time, and then just take time to do <laughs> Sorry. I I'm, I look like an infecti. I hate night fever, but that's how my stress just completely ravages my body, bro. Stress is a piece of shit. You will never guess how I have you guys propped up right now. Um, this blue eco style is absolute poop. It doesn't hold anything down. Um, but I just it my after it me use. Man, man, at this point. We're going to just utilize what we have a lines, right? So I'm just going to be doing the same style I did yesterday. Maybe, maybe not. I might be switching it up. I'm not sure. Knowing me. I don't know really. Oh, my God, too I if I go up this up. Um, so I'm going to put this on. Oh, my God, I've done you. All right, so um, I'm just going to be styling my hair and talking to you guys again because I like being these talking videos. Um, even though, um, I think what I'm going to start doing is just go live on YouTube and these talking videos, but I like the power to, um, edit it. I may just have this video be one long video and just upload this to YouTube. That's what I'm going to do and don't edit anything. Okay. All right then. Um, I'm not quite sure what to say now. 
but yeah the blue eco style is absolute trash do not waste your time oh we can do like something on the bible we can do that um let's see what do we want to discuss um let's go to genesis 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 2 verse 7 I don't think most of them, I said this already, but um, somebody reminded me of it and I was like, do you know what? Let's do it, shall we? Um, Genesis 2 verse 7. I'm going to use this. I like this Gorilla Glue. Even though Gorilla Glue is so messy, but I like it. As right, so Genesis 2 verse 7, then the Lord formed a... Um, no! Right, Genesis 7 verse 2. Take with you seven pairs of every kind of clean animal, a male and a female, and one pair of every kind of unclean animal, a male and its mate. But in the Bible, um, your, your pastors and your church leaders only preach the second part, where say the pair. Them not preach the part, we say, um, the first part was the seven, just the very first part, you know, the very, very first part, them not preach. So no, one would think, hmm, how come at the very, very first part of the scripture, you know me of a thing, but in the middle part, you never tell me. Why? Because the, them heard from one pastor, and the part they la chant to them, or as them say, it, um, spoke to their spirit, or whatever, and um, it's that the Lord press upon them for you now to bring to feed them congregation. But, you know, all human spirits here, um, them have to do it better than whoever. So, um, them take on the message you now for do it better than the other pastor. And nobody is searching the word of God for themselves. There is no seek me and you shall find when you have sought me with all your heart. There is no that. There is no desire for God. There is no drive for God. And I'm going to say this again. The fact that I have night fever right now is because I have been speaking out loudly against. I've been making this conversation. And I don't know if I can tell my body language, but I've been using my middle finger a lot. Um, you guys need to watch Believing Bruce. I'm going to post him in the description. I really hope I remember. So yeah. Um, he has just taught me a lot about that, like confirming what the Bible has said. You see me? Because with believing Bruce, I think I am not liking this. Let me see if I can do that. With it is absolutely obvious that your body gives you away. Let me explain. Even when you try to lie, it will never be successful because your body itself it it gives you away it's going to it's going to say hey i'm lying or there is um something that is that ha that has an opposing thought that is active you see me and that is what your body does now when i started watching believing bruce and i mean i understood that immediately because that is said that we're made in his image and his likeness and what the bible said about god god is a man that he cannot lie because I really want to introduce him to Jamaica to or or platform from that perspective because that is just like another step into us taking back our mental health in like our hands you see me why do you do what you do and that's the journey that i've been on now for a couple of years you see me more um aggressively for a couple of months where I want to know why I do the things that I do why am I like that? There's no way I'm just wake up and see so. And yes, if trauma is involved, well, not know that we have a genesis. We we have an atom bomb. We, we 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 have a source. Let's see what we can do then. Not find out what the source is and then stay. That makes you a punk. And Vivian and Verna, them never grow no kitty. No my love and and she that me. No, no, what is a give up? And that is why, and I'm going to say this again, for those of, for those of us who, who feel like, so we're cursed, our boy, who things are liquid, one after the other, one after the other. The only reason it's happening to you like that is because you refuse to give up in a baby. Remember, say, by, by being made in, that is image and his likeness. When Lucifer fell, whatever connection he had, 
it fell with him. He no longer has that connection that we have with God. Whether or not you're a Christian, please understand there's a raw connection. No accepting, G no, I don't say accepting, no believing what Jesus did. After reading the Bible, you know, all of a sudden they sit down with it, makes sense. And, you know, you start, well, no, who is this Jesus? You start reading about and then something they hear. When all that start take place, boom, you're good, you're in. You sign and seal, my love. And then for some of us now, for like like this girl, she extra. Oh, and I will start to, in um the, the, the facility that I went to, that we should be, like, baptizing over and over and over is okay. And I thought it was okay too. But it was okay for where I was mentally. Because no, baptism isn't important to me. What is important to me is my relationship with God. What is important to me is my relationship with God. That's what's important to me. Not if I'm baptized or not how many times I got baptized. That's all that's important to me. Because supposing there's someone one day and I water gone. So my relationship with God, I go a doom. Coming on water, no man. The emphasis must always be your relationship with God, and it never the after effects, and never the um not not interim. God is the beginning and the end, the Alpha and Omega. In sinus, he loves everything, brother. Oh, that looks stupid. I'm going to comb it up. I'm just comb it up here. Yeah. Make it curly, curly. Oh. Ow. voice over time so as you guys know how i apply my glitter i put on um the glue on my eyebrow slash skin and i put the glue on in the shape that i want the glitter to go on to to create the shape bro that i want if that makes sense so the shape of the bro that i want that is how i put on the glue and then i just adhere the glitter um to that area to the areas that have the glue so i basically get the bro shape before i actually put the glitter on now when it comes up to cleaning your brows um there's another method you can use that is way more effective less messy and it's with tape i highly recommend you using tape um yeah it just it's just less messy in my opinion and i recognize that um i think you guys are thinking that um whenever i do my eyebrows that is with the glitter using the foundation slash concealer that is actually doing something honey that's texture concealer foundation doesn't color texture discoloration yeah but not texture so you'll up uh, closer when you look closer you'll always see like the the the, the foundation on top of the glitter it's not doing anything you guys it's just going on top of the glitter <sighs> so now i'm just applying my foundation the foundation i'm using is one from a company that don't want to respond to me so i'm lucky i know i'm being petty in a voiceover but whatever um but i say black opal so I, black opal is hella good god damn there's a company no matter how hard i try no matter how hard i try the company i read yeah and i'm not on for me okay so i using sasha i use it Every single day, it's just ah, oh, it's so good. Like, look at that, it's so good. It's so good. Update on my skin, by the way. It's a command. So right now, we I use black radiance. I'm not even know the name. Come that I talked to now. while like, but this this is the powder I've been using. Um as like my pre-powder so i put this powder on first and then another powder on top that was probably uh, darker i recognize that is not really utilized in makeup artistry is um <sighs> i call it toning and basically it's just matching your foundation your face is multi-dimensional and i'm just giving it a little like um excerpt <laughs> from my classes but your face is multi-dimensional there's not just one foundation that fits everywhere on your face. If it fits your entire face, it means that like this area is probably lighter, this area is darker. But that one foundation is like your best match, your closest match, or the one that matches your neck or the rest of your body that's exposed, right? When it comes to your powders as well, you have to layer your powders. Um, I go in depth with the summer classes, but I just figure I want to put it right here now as I'm talking to you because I have on powders on my face, lighter than me, darker than me, all over the place. But because I'm contouring, which is another technique that I use in my classes as well that I do not show here on YouTube, that's because it is more for my students, one, and it's more for film and photography. The makeup that I do on YouTube is just for preference. It's not for film and photography. I do my makeup to satisfy YouTube, but 
I don't do this on a day-to-day -day basis. If I'm doing, if I'm on a set, I'm going to I you use the appropriate skills um, to execute what look I have to execute on that day given the circumstances. You get me? With that being said, my classes are 95 US dollars when you register. It is in total 495 dollars so $95. You automatically become VIP, which means you'll be gifted um, a set of our Pomi brushes, a Pomi fitness belt, and uh, each of our lashes as well. And um, what else did we do? Lashes, the brushes, and the belts. Yeah. Um... And I'm having classes in Connecticut and I'm having classes in New York. <laughs> yeah, Long Island, New York and Bridgeport, Connecticut. I'm so hyped, you guys. I mean, I've been to Long Island already. But I'm so hyped to go back. I'm so hyped to go back. I'm so hyped to go back to New York to see my girls. Like, I'm hyped. I'm hyped. And I want to see. And I also want to do a Pomi pop-up shop as well. I'm going to see how that goes. But, yeah. Okay, so I'm using the same Black Radiance um, powder, as you can see, to do my brows. And in terms of my eyeshadows, I I don't have a rhyme or reason whenever I'm choosing like my eyeshadows. I just go with what I'm feeling, what I'm vibing. So I most times use the same colors, and I'm sorry if it tends to be repetitive. But um, I tend to create my look for the day. As well as I know for that they may be more work on something specific so that me tend to do. But I really hope you guys like this look. I have not done a glitter. I have not been doing glitter brows and I love glitter brows. So I think I'll be staying in this sweet spot for a while. Simply because I've been doing a lot of colored brows. And honestly after doing the colored brows for a while and I was getting bored. And now going to glitter brows. I'm like yo colored brows are way way easier. The glitter it takes too much. It's, it's a lot to do. But the, the look though. Glitter brows make me look Oh, it makes me look phenomenal. Glitter brows makes me stand out. In person, I look, I look so, I look like art in person, like like living art. That's why I love glitter brows. It is a statement piece, man. I mean, colored brows, they're like a, like like an eye catcher, like a head turner. But glitter brows, bitch, that's art. It, it my face looks different. It's just lit differently. So for my um for my lash line and my lower lash line, I applied my. I cut my, my, my black eyeliner pencil, then I apply that on my tight line, a tight line my eyes as well, and put apply the same eyeliner pencil on my lashes, like you guys can see. I know I'm just um, blending out on top there of my top lash line. Now the reason why I did that, I don't normally line my eyes, but I did it because I'm going to be putting. I'm gonna put on my lashes. Sometimes if I put it too on the skin, it's uneven. So that's my little fail safe, just in case I make a little mistake. That's my fail safe, and that's and how. I wanted to position position the lashes as well i wanted there to be a, um like a lined effect underneath so now um I, I put on the lighter eyeshadows underneath and then i'm going in with a darker powder and then i'm going with the black eyeliner usually i do the eyeliner first and the powders no matter no more of the powder first then i'm gonna go with the black eyeliner and you know it, it do it's supposed to do it work so now we're just going to blend that out and now i um hold one this is the eyeliner because i use see there yeah, that's the pen that I use. I love it. I love it. It's just... And then I use that to line back on top to give it depth. Because when I applied the eyeshadows, it was kind of losing. You see, it looked a little bit crisp because of the line. The, the, the black eyeliner defined it. And that's what I wanted, the definition. As for my eyeshadows, I was saying earlier, I just grab random stuff. I, I just take colors that I like. If, if you notice me, if I'm using one palette, I rarely deviate from that palette. That's because I don't want to confuse myself. Um... <laughs> I just want to stay in this little nice area right here. So, so my oh my gosh, my highlight from my baby Guile Cosmetics. <sighs> Black owned, woman owned, Jamaican owned, mom owned. Support Guile Cosmetics. They were linked in the bio, please. I hope I remember. Guys, if if I, if it's not linked in the bio when I'm doing this, um, just type it. So I remember to type it to her so I can link her website in the bio. Um, which other something you use? I'm gonna use not, I don't know, no. Yeah, just the mechanic for the one the buyer. But yeah, so this is the entire look, you guys. I do not have an outro. I do have an outro for this. I'm mad bad for not having an outro. But um, in terms of the lips, I used Simply Nude for my lips. And that's from Sasha as well. And it's LA Girl, I think, brown. It's called brown, I think, pencil. It's a, light, a nice light brown, sorry. Um, what else? What else? I do have a video coming up on my um, I call it herpes, but um, cold sore because I got rid of it in a day. 
as in the infection itself, the stinging, like a day. And it, oh, I want to share with you guys. I think my aftercare is screwing up though, but you know how my life is. I'm probably gonna perfect this whole sort of thing <laughs> to all my life. I got my lover, but um, yeah, where's my fatilla now? Crap, I don't want to forget it now. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you have not subscribed, please go ahead and subscribe. And also, um, oh, I said it in the intro already. Oh, good. I'm trying to do voiceovers, okay? So forgive me if I seem a little bit repetitive. And forgive me if I seem I'm unprepared. I wanted to do a voiceover and then I didn't know what to say. But I just didn't want to play the music. And most times, almost at a lot of times, most times, the music is so much easier for me to do. You remember, I don't have the boys this weekend, so I can do a voiceover. I don't have the boys, so I can just do a voiceover. I have more time. But, um, yeah, oh, gosh, man. My lashes, you guys, are now available at Vivian. I don't, I don't wear the lashes in this video. I wear them with the other tutorial. My Ross, I have two more tutorials after this to blows and skirt. So the other one, or the next one. Not, it's alright. See, after the tutorial here, I got one next one. I come up, another one. The next one after that, that. That, that. That, that. Yeah, that, that, that. So, but I'm telling from no, yeah. So, uh, on my website, shopbalerie.com, you can shop all the lashes. Unfortunately, or fortunately for me, unfortunately for those of you who want to support me, I only have 10 of each style left on the website. Um, less than 10, I have to go, yeah, less than 10, I have to adjust it. I have less than 10 left on the website. Um, for the lashes and in person, they're at Vivian's Beauty Supply in Portmore Shop, 69 Portmore Pines Plaza. Where Island Grill is, yeah, Shop 69 Put My Pine Plaza. That's where my lashes are. They're at Vivian's Beauty Supplies. They are for 800 Jamaican dollars. Come next week, Sunday. Next week, Sunday, which date? Next week, Sunday is the 19th. So next week, Sunday on the 19th, they'll be for $1,000. My aim is to sell off all of these lashes before next week, Friday. Yeah? Before, I'm making the date. Today are the 12th. Yeah. No, I can't the advice over the day. Yeah. Today's the 12th. Before the Friday, the Friday, to the Friday, before the 17th. <laughs> before the 17th, they need to be done. Everything needs to be done. Nothing for left on the website. Nothing for left on Vivian. They needs to be done. Yeah, me na, no, brother. Yeah, man, they need to move so I can. Out of the next one, them dog. Come on, I'm so dog, dog. I'm, I just can't wait, bro. So I'm just like, I need this to just be sold. So I'm hella excited. I'm hyped. Um, so all my energies are going to be pushed into selling off these lashes, and I eat bills alone for them. Eat bills for them. <laughs> Eight hundred dollars. <laughs> I'm so happy. Um, what else do I have to say? Oh, I put in glitter. So I put the same glue I use on my eyebrows to put right there. So on where my eyes are. And then I use the glitter from Sasha Cosmetics as well. It's a glitter. So it will get in your eyes and scrape you and blindalize you. So be extremely careful, which is why I wet my brush. I always, you can wet it with, um, Fix Plus or water or whatever. It's my brush. I don't share and I use my saliva. So uh, it's just it's completely up to you, man. Alright, you guys, so, okay, I'm gonna, sorry, my mind wandered, I have a lot to do, so after this, I have to do some more work, but guys, thank you for your support, I truly appreciate it, you guys, and I have to go back over the black liner, but come down, put the glitter, and so, more want more, more on the depth, come down a little bit more, I love it, but as I said, I don't have any, um, videos or nothing at all, because it was just difficult working this day, and I think I had forgotten to do, like, an after- um, video thing but this is the look you guys thank you for watching please go ahead and check out my website um where you can shop my lashes and my pomi fitness belts shop by lyric.com and you can go on my other website lyric i'm sorry other website as told by lyric.com and on that website you can re register for my classes in bridgeport connecticut and in long island new york mama <laughs> open the door <laughs> all right guys thank you so much for watching thanks for the support and i'll talk to you guys later